so I'm ugly without a beard? You know, you're not ugly. I just love your beard. I just love your... No! So I'll be ugly like this, y'all? No! <laughs> Squad. It's your boy Jay. Yo, it's your boy Vel. Hello, y'all. Yo, it's been like what? Almost so two long. months since we did a YouTube video. It's getting to the point. I don't even want to keep saying we're going to do these videos. We're just going to go ahead and just do it. We're just gonna yeah, just, we just, we're just going to stop talking about yeah, it. Yeah, we, we're going to so basically start like, be, not, not talking about it, just, just be about it. It's just been a lot going on. Like, uh, I was we was gonna do a separate video, but we might as well just cram it all into this because it's really not too much. But I mean, like you know, we human at the end of the day. Like we go through things just like everybody else. Like and then just like the average couple. Like we have times like you know, like when things aren't good. Like everything's not always gonna be good. But I'm not gonna get too deep into all of that. But I mean, like that's basically where we was for that time we've been gone. But I mean, of course, you know, we got everything together and here we are. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you want to tell them or? We both can. Okay. So yeah, we're not actually having a wedding. We're not. We're not. So we decided we are going to have a one year anniversary reception. And we're going to make it kind of feel like a wedding, like... We ain't gonna have like basically it's gonna almost feel like a wedding. It's just we're not gonna have the whole serious part, like you know, the bridesmaids and all them. Yeah. Like the people like doing all that. The ring and then yeah. doing do it like saying our vows like that. We're gonna have like we're gonna sell we're gonna have a celebration somewhere with family and friends. Yeah. Our one year of being one year of marriage. Yeah. We're just gonna have like a like the um the reception. That's yeah. basically all we're gonna do. Right. And we're going to still dress up and wear our colors and decorate everything and make everything look nice. It's going to feel like a wedding. Like I said, it's just not going to have the serious part. Like, the all the people that's a part of the wedding and the first beginning. Like, the, cer the, wedding, cer the wedding ceremony. ceremony. Yeah. <laughs> but other than that, it's still on. Yeah. And we're still having it next month on our date, July 23rd. It'll be a year. Yeah. So, but... There's only one thing though, the location changed though. Yeah, our location changed. So I know we did a video on our page last year and y'all seen the venue. That's not where we're gonna be at anymore. We're actually gonna start a clip right here so y'all see our new venue. And it's a lot cheaper too. Yeah. Way cheaper. So here's the video. It's big too, told you. I was saying like, I was thinking we can probably sit like right there. Like our table can probably be like right here. Well, this is it. What y'all think about it? Y'all like that? It's I, cool. I like it. It's, 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 it's a real decent size. Yeah, it's just like, it's cool. It's enough for what we're going to do. We're going to play Let's Get Deep. Again, because it's been requested by a few people. They wanted to see a part two, so we're going to give y'all a part two. Right. We also have a lot of new JV Squad members, so we want to shout y'all out. Welcome to the squad. No, for real. We're going to try our best not to disappoint y'all with the uploads coming also y'all can follow us on tiktok too though like we really will post like more on there but i mean we're gonna like i said we're gonna do our thing on here at least once a week but you might see more of us on tiktok we might be live on there and all of that so yeah yeah everything will be listed below and yeah. um i think that's pretty much it so let's get into this game would you rather your partner help with the dishes or help with the laundry Laundry, but dishes, we don't dishwasher, so what's the point? Same. 
<laughs> I mean, I hand wash dishes too. Don't get it twisted. But most of the time, them things going in the dishwasher. Yeah. With some bleach and stuff. So, yeah. Yes. Okay. So, Sanji for sure. Uh, you're deeper. Okay. Damn, we starting with the icebreaker. You don't want to take it slow. You just want to ram that shit up in there. I sure do. I want to get all the details. Okay. Oh, what's something you never try again? Why? Something I'll never try again? Mm-hmm. Uh, it's a lot of things, but I think I'm going to say, because I recently said this, I never, ever get on another roller coaster really i'm so <laughs> serious like i don't know like i'm just terrified of heights like i'm really terrified of heights and i just be seeing so much and i just be so paranoid uh and i'm getting older now like i don't i'm not that the old me is gone like i mean i always been terrified of heights but i used to i would get on a roller coaster and stuff back then but now mm -mm. Uh, I have a heart of stroke on there. What? Nope. Right. I never get on a roller coaster ever again. Mark my words. Okay. Mm. Me? What's on you? What's on my never try again? Oh man, I can't even think right now. Oh, what's on never try again? Smoke cigarettes. Next. What did you used to do with all your free time before we started dating? Oh damn, you all been my business, ain't you? Uh, if I tell you, you're gonna be like, what the hell? Oh, uh, whoa, Christian Mingo. Oh my god. Boy, I don't wanna hear it. <laughs> <laughs> mm, it's pretty much the same thing. Like, I mean, not Christian Mingles, but I mean, stuff that I do now. Like, I mean, when I had free time, like I used to just used to be in traffic. Just say that I be, I still be in traffic now. Like the gas price is high as hell right now. I still do the same stuff I did. <laughs> like yeah, nothing's changed. Okay, I agree to you. Old music or new music? Definitely old music. No, for real. Like this new music nowadays, I don't be getting it. But like it's cool. Some of it's cool. But can't nothing top old music. Old music definitely had meaning to man, it. Man, I, I tell got you, old soul, me so. too, man. I have a real old song. I listen to songs in the 70s, 80s, and 90s. Oh, you, 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 when I mess with my 90s music, dog, I have a whole 90s on my Apple music. There's a right in the wrong way to You know me so well. Hey. I'll be listening to that song like almost every day. Okay. Yeah, definitely old music. Yes. If you know you were going to die tomorrow, what would you do on your last day? I don't... I would try to spend as much time with my friends and family. That's true. And, I mean, it ain't no point in going on no shopping spree because I'm going to be dead tomorrow, so... Can't take it with yeah. you. Yeah. So... I just spend as much time I can with my friends and family. That's true. I agree with you on that. Okay, next to me. Uh, what is the grossest thing I've seen you do? Oh my god. Mm, what is the nastiest thing I've seen you do? Um, do I really want to put all your business out there like that? Or should I just this watch your part? No. Oh. How you going to tell me what I think the nastiest thing you did? Um, I don't know. Oh, maybe he embarrassed y'all. He think I'm about to. Boy, I it's care. like nah. I think I'm gonna take it easy on you because I ain't gonna put your business out there like that. I think the nastiest thing I seen you do was like when you was bleeding one time, like on your finger or your arm or something. You slurped it up. Okay. I think that's and you ain't the only person I seen do that. I think that's so nasty, like. So you mean telling you was licking like a little bit bad? You were licking your like, nose? I up. never know. I'm just going to go wipe it off. Like, What if I ain't had to wipe off, though? I'm wiping it off on something. No, I'm not about to. Ugh. I'm not about to. Ugh. Hell no. Ugh, hell. That's what? trifling. Like, I hate when people do that, too. Like, that's trifling. Boy. Blood is nasty. Like, 
you have plans with a friend, but on the day before you get the opportunity to do something much more exciting, what do you do? I was like, come on, bitch, let's go. They can't come, though. Fine, friend, let's do some other time. Friend, I'm going to just have to leave you hanging. I'll tell you about it, though. I'm going to take pictures. But, but 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 we had plans, though. I don't feel bad. I feel like a bad friend yeah, doing that. Yeah, friends and people cancel shit all the time. And it but, might be that one day they're going to probably be like, you my friend, I got to cancel. They're like, oh, dang, okay, it's cool. When y'all hang up, shit, I'm glad you canceled. Snatch your wig off and go back to bed. Oh, gosh. Never know. Cause that was so. I'm going to see that once in a lifetime thing or whatever it is. No, for real. Friend, I'll catch you another time. Close your eyes. Your partner gets to hide one object from the room, and you must guess what's missing. Oh my god. Uh, hide something. Me? Yeah. As if I'm gonna guess what it is. I know you lying. You hiding a car? No. You making me nervous. What is you doing? Wake up. Wake up. You gonna be did off. you show them what it is? Yes, I did. It's something in your hand. I don't have my hand. What the hell was over here? Cause you came straight over here like you just knew what you was doing. <laughs> oh, um, I don't know what the hell. Like you could have hit. Like, all right. I really don't. Um, three. My wallet. Mm -mm. What the hell is all that noise under there? I didn't think I got them visas. Hey. You were supposed to take it out the room. Oh, but it was in my pocket, though. I guess. I got them credit cards, you know, about to go shopping. A couple more, y'all, because this video getting pretty long. Okay. Oh, I know you. I know you. I know you had one. Who was your favorite teacher and why? Oh, my God. You got a good memory. Come on. I know you remember. You only got some, some favorite teachers. The now. fact that I didn't even like school or the teachers or nobody, that's the thing that's blowing the hell Ooh, out of me. What about that, what about that lady uh, at the, uh, at the uh, Duffy place? Uh, she wasn't a teacher. She was a security guard. Well, shit. She was, she was, that don't count. Was, um, if I have to say, I'm going to say, because I always think about this, I'm going to say my first grade teacher. Her name was Miss Fields. And I'm saying that because she was so nice. And then I remember when I went to second grade, it was the first day of second grade. And I guess they had like all of our names on a list in the hall, but I must've missed that memo. So I didn't know like where to go. Like I didn't know how to find my classroom or nothing. So I, what did I do? I went straight to Miss Fields class. My first grade teacher, I went straight to her classroom. And I remember I was crying cause I was so upset. <laughs> I didn't know where to go in my class at. So I was crying. So I was like, Miss Fields, I don't know what class I'm supposed to go to. And then she was like, oh no, Jesse, hold on. I'm going to take you and we can go find out. So we had, uh, went to the office and, well, I guess she knew because she went straight to the damn list. And mm -hmm. she seen like second grade and she was like, oh, look, there's your name right there. She said, you're going to be in Miss Bauman's class. And I forgot, I think the room one, yep, it was 115. She was like, it's room 115. So she walked me all the way to 115. Don't you remember the room number? Yep, and her classroom number was 120. Dude, you got I want to say 120. Really like just... 120, I think. It was like 120. But yeah. No, 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 no. Miss no. Bill's classroom number was... It was 120 something, but I remember 115 for sure. But yeah, she walked me all the way to my second grade class, and I love her for that. Okay. Because <laughs> she you, gave a damn. Not you remember the room number, though. That's like, uh, like 124. Sorry. But that was Miss Fields' uh, classroom number. Do your teacher. You had a favorite teacher? Let's see, field grade teacher, he was arrested. Uh, let's see, uh, I'm trying to remember. You didn't have no favorite. You was a badass kid. Your favorite was probably the ISS teacher. Uh, was Amazon the her? 
I don't know who she is. I just know the ISS teacher because she was bad. So that was probably all the bad kids' favorite teachers. Whatever. What is your favorite feature of your partner? Ooh, easy, his beard. I'm cutting it off tomorrow. You better the fuck not. <laughs> so if I cut my beard off, you ain't gonna care about me no more? I'll go, I'll go buy another beard and you wear it. You can't, I'm not wearing no look nice front beard. Okay. But still, your beard makes you look more like. So I'm ugly without a beard? You know, you're not ugly. I just love your beard. I just love your. No. So I'd be ugly like this, y'all? No. I just. No. I'm the crazy part is I encourage him to grow his beard out, actually. Did I? I had a beard before, but not a full beard. You like didn't know. You had like a chin beard, but you didn't have no, a full beard. No, I had. I definitely you, had this but before. You, but you started to grow, but you said it was I'm me. saying I didn't have a full beard. I had beards way before you. But my you hair didn't grow enough. Yeah. I had a beard before, it just wasn't a full beard. And I couldn't have it at that fucking job I worked at. But hey, you found a job, look, see? Yep, two weeks later, that's crazy. I would say your eyes. My eyes? Yeah. Uh, you said best feature. Oh, uh, I'm still gonna say about the shotgun right here, it's the skin. Boy. <laughs> Hell well. Next. All right, okay. we're going to do one more round. Okay, who was your first celebrity crush? Why? Oh, my God. Mine was Christina <laughs> Milian. Oh, who was that? Boy, you know exactly who Christina Milian is. Don't play like that. Um, Have you ever seen Love Don't Cost a Thing? Oh, that was her? Yeah. Oh, my bad. I was in love with her. That's crazy. <sighs> now look at me. In love with a man. What you How do you let a man bend you off? I ain't no man bending me off. Oh, so you doing the bending? <laughs> I'm <was like, laughs> All right, who's yours? I like hood rat chicks. Who? Hood rat chicks. Yeah, hood rat chicks. Yeah, I like hood rat chicks. Okay, this is my last card. I think I'm on. Oh, let me see. I need a booger and it tastes like shit. Ooh, don't do that one. Please don't. My mama told me to pick the very best one and you are not it for the rest of your entire year. Remember they used to be like, Lee, 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 Because they used to try to not pick their friends so they'd be like, Lee, Lee, Lee. Nah, bitch, you cheating at this point. Just say the whole regular thing, entire life. Have you ever had a near-death experience? I don't think so. I have a couple of times. Well, you don't see a deer? No, like that ain't just, <laughs> I, I'm not even thinking about that. I'm talking about some shit, some real shit. I almost said that, well, I set the house on fire. Is it because your ass sets a fire? I jumped in a lake when I was two years old. Jump and save Trying me. to be too grown. Um, And then the other ones was car related like I was in the car and like people was like like when we was in Houston that time and Steven had uh swerved over if he didn't have the handles he had mm -hmm. we would have got fucked up and that's just like that one time we was in the car with Mike and he had them handles we would have got fucked and that one was on my side so yeah I definitely had a lot of life death close experiences I shouldn't even be here right now but you here though but I'm here so guys, that was it. No, was, you got one more. Me? Yeah. <sighs> oh! Uh, I should just let him have it. Oh my God. If you won the lottery, what would you do with the money? Okay, okay, okay. This is what I'll do. So if I won the lottery, right? I will buy my mama a new house because she got that house she in right now. Boy, don't be telling my mama in law business on here like that. No, that's else is cool. She got a roof over her head at the end of the day. I know that, duh. I don't want to buy her a newer, better house. I want to buy her a house. I will buy us a house. Uh, I'll buy my dream car. And also, well, well that'd be last. But no, nah, I actually will open my, have my own business, actually. Because I'm tired of working with people. Like, you think I'm gonna keep cleaning asses the rest of my life? No. I wanna just have my own business. I wanna 
I'll, I'll always see myself have my own barbershop. I do, like, see, I, I do my hair. I do my husband's hair, a lot of hair a little bit, you know. I want to have my own barbershop slash uh, soul food kitchen restaurant. That's, that's, that's clutch. Right, babe? Soul food? Yeah, soul food in a barbershop. Mm. What? Okay. So what would you do if you were a lottery? I know you I will pay all my debts off first. You don't have no baby. You don't have no debts. I have debts. I ain't got no. I'm human. I ain't got nothing to lie about. I got debts, <laughs> and I will pay them all off. Then I would mm, give my mom some money, and of course, he bought me all the fur coats I want. Boy, all right. <laughs> I'll go buy you a raccoon. A raccoon. <laughs> it ain't polar bear or. Well, I mean, that's what I meant to say, like a beer or something. Yeah. Um, and then, I mean, I would invest in it. Like, I would really invest in it. Mm -hmm. And and also, one thing I learned, save your damn money, too, because you never know when you court here rock, 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 rock bottles. Save your money, trust me. All right, Pleasure P. What? Let's push the P, actually. It's Pleasure P. It's that pushing. song that got called uh, Rock Bottom, definitely by Pleasure P. Oh, yeah, but I'll push the P because I push, hey, I'll push buttons. All right, I'm going to let you get up out of here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, y'all. We hope you guys enjoyed this video, our first video back. Oh, yeah, it's also Pride Month. So, yes. happy Pride to everybody. We might do another Pride photo shoot this year, but we got to figure out what we're going to do. Yes. So, yeah. Um, that's it. We're about to get up out of here. We're about to get ready to bed. It oh, down. yeah, my show's on Bad Boys. Bad Boys oh, song. yeah, we're about to watch Bad Boys. So, yeah, if you are new to the channel, make sure you hit that like, subscribe, and comment on this video and share it to your family and friends. And also follow us on our social media, they will be listed below. And in the meantime, we're about to get up out of here. So, yes. it's your boy Jay. It's your boy Bill. And we are signing off. Oh, yeah, Ben Lee is doing very good job. He is six months old. Yeah, he's, he's six months old now. And he's he just turned six months a, a, a couple third. days ago. Yep, two a days third. ago. We uh, posted some pictures of him on our Instagram. So, y'all can go look at him on there. He's gotten so big. He's downstairs asleep right now. I will show y'all, but I don't want to wake him up and hype him up. So, yeah. Yep, he'll be in the next video for sure. So, we love you guys. Peace. Love you guys.